Mark Aiken. I'm president of One Media, which is uh, Sinclair Broadcast Group's innovation activity. Uh, the panel was about whether broadcast uh, ATSC 3.0 was a friend or foe with respect to 5G. And uh, the perspective, I think, that was offered by almost uh, all of the participants on the panel was a, a perspective that whether you're talking about technology or business objectives, um, uh, the answer is uh, yes and no. Uh, in, in a 5G world where you have the ability to work across multiple uh, wireless and physical uh, bearers of, of bits, you have, uh, you have an ability to, to bring these services together and transmit or broadcast or convey bits across the best medium. So it's not one size fits all. Broadcast one to many has, uh, has a very specific uh, uh, kind of bit and, uh, uh, and usefulness versus the unicast. Unicast is one on one, broadcast is one to everyone. Uh, and I, uh, I, I brought up the fact that, that I use this often that broadcast has an X factor. And the X factor is how many people are actually receiving those bits. So you may only be uh, streaming a two megabit uh, delivery. Uh, but if you have a million people that are receiving that two megabit uh, transfer, you've got two million megabits of, of effective transfer going on. Uh, and, and that's the kind of delivery that can't be done by, by other wireless unicast technologies. So friend or foe, uh, you know, technologically, uh, uh, it, I, I believe it'll be a challenge to 5G. Business-wise, it'll be a challenge to 5G. Uh, on, on the other hand, um, uh, it's very complementary. I think that the offload of data bits from congested networks to broadcast will have a, a high value, a, a high return uh, on, on the part of both parties. So uh, what do you want it to be, friend or foe? <laughs> I'm trying to maintain my objectivity. <laughs> uh, all right. Well, I mean, obviously, well, you're on the, on the broadcast and cable side. Oh, definitely on the on the broadcast side. It's uh, I, I I think for all the right reasons, you know the the way that we serve the public, uh, based on local broadcasting first, uh, and the reach that we have as a group across the across the country, you know allow us to provide uh, you know differing viewpoints and uh, uh, entertaining comment content at the same time as providing vital services, uh, you know in in first, uh, you know, sort of first responder capacity to breaking weather events and, uh, and natural catastrophes and, uh, and the sort. So public service, um, I think uh, David Smith was quoted uh, just the other day as saying, at the end of the day, as a broadcaster, we put the public first.